Hey guys, 460 Style here today. Today I'm doing some of the behind the scenes stuff that a lot of people don't see. Uh, when you reload, um, there is videos out there of like what Jerry Mitchellek does, but he does like tens of thousands of rounds. He has an oven, he has like a stove, but um, this is how everybody kind of starts out. Uh, this is how I started out. Um, it's worked well, it's a slow process. Uh, the noise in the background you see is, hold on here, there's my tumbler. I got some 460s in there right now. Uh, pretty much a bunch of different casings. 223, uh, everything in there, 7mm mag, 38 special, 357. It's loud, but seems a lot louder right now because I'm doing this video, but um, as far as you can see, I got all my buckets here. Uh, I'm going through. What happens is when you actually mix, um, put it back on the, pod, on the tripod here, guys. What happens is when you mix different casings with each other, they tend to get stuck. Like here's a 223 and a 44 Magnum. So you take it apart and you're going to have some media in there now. So you got to make sure you take out the media. Um, to make sure these are empty, but I can't see right through them yet because the, the primers are not out. Make sure there's no stuff inside it. So once you take out the primers, you can see, then you can take your brush, go in there, clean the primer pocket, the hole, the flash hole, and stuff like that. And uh, I put them in the bucket, go right through, uh, put whatever casings need to go where, and that's where you start. Uh, this is the basic setup. Um, works for me you know I don't shoot thousands of rounds a week I probably shoot maybe a hundred combined um, you know, handgun rifle shotgun not so much because uh, I like to shoot skeet and usually it takes two people to shoot skeet and I don't usually have a volunteer to shoot skeet so I can't go with one hand I could and a lot of guys do the the, uh, the trick shot stuff with skeet uh, I don't have that budget <laughs> So anyway, but here I am just playing around behind the scenes stuff, what you got to do to reload uh, casings, bullets, whatever, uh, the prep stuff, and basic setup, that's how it starts, uh, start small, work your way up, if you got a budget to go bigger, better, uh, the sonic uh, cleaner, the liquid stuff works very well also, but I'm still kind of old school. Uh, as you know, I worked in the machine shop with a lot of old school machinery. So, uh, a lot of hands on it. Hands on uh, things here. Your hands get dirty. If you're afraid to get your hands dirty, this is not a hobby for you. Because <laughs> your hands will get dirty. Um, it's just the way it is. You're touching brass, you're touching metal, you're touching powder, oil. Um, so, here it is. 460 style. Keep real. Keep the same. Bring everybody to the range. What's your style? What's the style?